Hi planner friends, it's Marcia with Buy Sell Plan. Welcome back. In today's video, I am going to share with you my latest Franklin Planner um, order. So all of this was sent to me by Franklin Planner. I did not purchase these. Um, so I'm very grateful that they did send these to me. I'm so excited. So this is all compact. As you know, I have started an everyday carry compact and I purchased the um, black onyx, or sorry, black onyx, the, uh, what's this called? Anna onyx. And I love it. Love it, love it, love it. But I got another compact. I got the macaroon. Let's open it. I'll go through this stuff um, in a minute. So I love that it came in this kind of linen um, tote. No, not a tote. Material. Whereas, you know, all of the other Franklin binders, well, classic anyways, every classic I've received have come in like a plastic cover. So this one came in a nice linen, uh, which I love. I love, I, I feel like it's better. So I got the macaroon. I have been obsessed with this binder ever since it came out or ever since I discovered it. Um, but all they have on the Franklin Planner site is this olive color as well as an, like an orangey color. And orange, definitely not me. So I thought, you know what, let's try the olive green. I, I definitely need to see it in person. It is absolutely beautiful. I am so excited. I am so excited to have this one in my lineup and we'll see how it goes. I, I, I wish that they had the macaroon binder in classic because I would love this in a class. Sorry, they do have it in classic, but the, the rings I think are only an inch and in a classic, I need one and a half, minimum one and a quarter, but uh, one and a half fits perfectly. Like it suits my needs perfectly. So I could not deal with, um, I could not deal with a one inch classic binder unless I was using it for something specific. Like let's say I only had finances in there. Cause I do know of some planner babes that I see on YouTube where they'll have a binder that's just for finances or just for home, like home management, things like that. I don't really plan that way. Um, but if I did, I guess a one inch binder would, would be fine for that. All right. So I'm just going to kind of push it down. So this is a simulated leather. It's not real leather. Uh, if you were to purchase this, it would be $104.95 plus tax. And the rings are 0.875. So they're under an inch, which I think is perfect for a compact if it's an everyday carry. Okay, so what I love, and I love this in the pictures too, so it's, it's even better in person, is it has one two, three, four, five card holders, including the window. I love, I love that it has this here so you can put something that's um, taller in this one. It has a pocket here. On the other side, it has another pocket here and it has a pocket here. So you can put something really long, maybe a, well, maybe a, if you had a narrow notepad, although I don't, I don't think, no, I don't have a narrow uh, notepad, but you could put like something longer in there or if you wanted to put, you know, stickers that you use a lot, um, you could do, these would look really nice. These are the Franklin Planner sticky notes. Or is it too thick? No, nope. see, that could, that could fit in there. And how pretty is that? So yeah, that's cool. It comes with two black page lifters as every Franklin Planner binder does, except the Teresa Collins um, binders have the clear. So I like that. I love it. It has one pen loop and it's stretchy. Well, actually there is no um, elastic on it like there are with the other binders, but it is a big one so you can fit a thicker pen in there and you should have no problem. You should have no problem at all with that. Okay, and I love the flower on the buckle. It's a snap enclosure. There's no pockets or anything on the back. I love this pattern. And the stitching is, it's, um, 
it's not white it's it kind of has a greenish tinge to it so anyways it's beautifully made it is just absolutely beautiful i love it and this reminds me of they have some chanel or they chanel has some binders out there with like a flower that looks similar to that i don't know if it's identical and it has this quilting on it so this reminds me of that love it love it love it love it and i figured the blooms would look so nice with this and when i opened it i was like oh my god it's perfect all of these colors it's just perfect so i got the blooms day on two uh sorry the weeklies and no pages so everything matches and then i got the planner love uh, my mind's eye so the franklin planner my mind's eye um, planner love collab um, pocket dividers and i figured those would um, match like the greenish ones will match really well with that okay so let's open up the inserts need some scissors I'm so excited for these. Okay. So here we go. It's so neat seeing, seeing these in uh, miniature. So it's July start. So it's July 2021 to June 2022. Compact size. It's the weekly planner. And it's two pages per week. So on the front page, you have your page so your your information will go there and then you have your calendar so you're here at a glance here so 2021 and 2022 on the left and this is just a quick reference guide on how to use the Franklin planner system and then it gets into your monthlies so they come with the 12 months of the year they start with July was as uh, this is a July start and you can see it's a month on two pages so pretty so you have all your months they're all the same you have your master task list um, on the back so for personal and business not sure how much I'll use this will probably be more for like a brain dump when I'm not at home um, that I can jot things down and then when I get home I'll add it to my my catch-all for when I do my weekly planning and then we get into the inserts here and there you go just like what I've been using I've been using the weekly uh, in my classic as well so you have Monday to Sunday and you have it's timed so these only go until six and let me see just real quick in my classic Yeah, they go till eight. So I thought, I thought so. So they go till eight and then they have a spot down here. If you have um, something else that you've scheduled either before 8 p.m. or 8 a.m. So that's how these differ. They do start at 8 a.m., but they end at 6 p.m. Okay. You know, I really wish the entire year was this, this exact pattern with the pink. I think these are peonies. They're just so beautiful. But, so one thing I do like about these is that um, you can see that July starts, so you have July, August, September, which is the, are these pink colors, and then they get into um, a, like a darker pink, and then they get into the green tones, and so do your inserts. So they match, they match the month that you're in. So here's your July, actually, maybe they don't, I thought they did, because here's October. But your October is pink. But your October monthlies are the same, just not the color of the tab. All right. So that's really it for the inserts. There's nothing more really to flip through because each week is the same. So you have your weekly tasks on the one side and then you open it up for your week. And then on the back you have a spot for notes and then it starts over again. And that's it for the whole year. Okay. And then I got the Bloom's uh, lined pages for notes. So it gives you all four patterns that are in here. So it gives you the tulips, the, I think those are peonies. Um, what are the white ones? So there's your tulips. 
beautiful. And I do like the tulips too. So the pink ones and the tulips are my favorite. Not sure what this flower is. It's a white flower. What are those? I don't know what those are. It's hard to tell. Um, anyhow, but yeah, so the line paper matches. Okay, and then I do like that they give you all four and not just one. So if you're taking notes in a, in a given week and you want to keep your notes with your inserts, I like that they match. Okay, so we have these four pocket folders. I think the green, the green one is going to match the best. So I'm probably going to use either this one. This is top priority. This one says beautiful. I feel like those, yeah, those are going to match the best. So I'm going to, I'll be using one of these. So why don't we put some inserts in here and see how it looks. Now, as far as dividers, I have ordered cloth and paper clear tab dividers, the CEO tab dividers because right now in my compact I have the pink girl gang ones which are nice you know I, lo I love pink pink's my favorite color so they're nice but I wanted something different for this one the pink I guess would look good because there's a lot of pink in these inserts but um the thing is is that I am I've just learned the difference between personal versus personal wide and the tab dividers that I have my pink ones the top tab dividers those are personal they're not personal wide I did not know that so I will be keeping all 12 months in here and I'm probably only going to have So these, I think, so you can see that these are much wider. Actually, I will show you. Just to give you an idea. So the personal are quite a bit shorter. So I don't know, you guys tell me, do you know, are these personal wide? I think they're personal wide and these are just personal. So I got personal wide for the tabbed dividers, hoping that they're going to be the same width as my Franklin planner inserts. So I will be sure to share that with you when they come in. Yeah, these pink ones would look really nice, but I want the clear ones. The only thing I'm, I'm a little bit concerned about with the um, CEO tabs that come in, they're going to be side tabs that hopefully they won't um, interfere with the pen loop too much because the pen loop does you can see it does um, the inserts go behind it okay so here is July and what I'm going to do is just have one month of um, my weeklies at a time I really wish this would lay flat I'm, I'm hoping eventually it will so put one month in here. Here we go. Cute. Isn't this beautiful, you guys? Do you like it? I love it. I absolutely love it. And now what pen? So the hardware is silver, which is a, I guess, uh, gold gold hardware would not look too good with the olive so that, I guess that makes sense so the question is is what pen would go well I love gold so I have so many that are gold um, let's see let's see if I can find a good pen I might have to get back to you on that on what pen I'm going to use maybe just a white one but it does have kind of like a rose gold hardware on it anyways I'll figure that out later I'll do a setup with this when my other stuff comes in but I just wanted to show you what it looks like so that's the macaroon 
binder in compact size. So I don't know if you can see that. So um, as you close it, you can see that the tabs or the inserts go underneath of the pen loop. So we'll see how that goes as I fill this with more stuff and actually have a pen in there. Should be okay. Um, yeah, we, we shall see. We shall see, but it is absolutely beautiful. It's so much better in person. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Oh yeah, I forgot about these guys. I usually put this just at the very end for receipts or loose papers, things like that. When I'm out and about, I have a place to put it. Looks beautiful. Love it. So that is it. That is my latest Franklin Planner haul. Thank you, Franklin Planner, for sending me these beautiful, beautiful products. For 15% off your Franklin Planner products, use my code buy, sell, plan, and enjoy. Um, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.